Hello, all my teacher preparation candidates out there at the Graduate School of Education here at Toro. This is Dr. Luis Santiago coming to you to help you figure out how do I know what class to schedule for next semester? Many of you have made appointments with me or have done uh, the drop-in hours with Dory. So both of those options are still available to you, but Dory and I were talking and thought it might be helpful if we just give you some hints and cheat sheets to, uh, to get you going here. I'm gonna share my screen and walk you through what you can do for yourself to always know what progress you're making uh, in terms of your courses and how to choose your course for the following semester. So the, this is a two page document that will be posted in the GSOE community and likely attached to this email message that you're gonna get below. I never know if attachments work in Canvas or not or where you're getting this from. So if it comes to you via email, you should get an attachment. So on the first page, you see just a blank template of a planning sheet. Notice that the first semester, that's the semester you're in now, uh, your courses are marked for the most part, but it may not be accurate for what you are doing this semester. Some of you are taking two classes, some of you are taking three. The first three classes that you see listed here are the ones required for you to be intern eligible. That way you can accept a teaching position if it were offered to you come spring and you can be the teacher of record. So the first three courses, EDUC 770, that's your um, Ed Psych and Classroom Management class with Sandra Bofill. Uh, EDUC 771 is your uh, class that you're working on with Vanessa Lovick CC on working with uh, uh, English learners and, and inclusion and in that, um, all that. And then EDUC either 772 or 773. If you are an elementary or multiple subjects credential candidate, you would have 772 with Casey Ramos. And if you're in a single subject or secondary a teacher credential candidate, you would have um, EDUC 773 with Zarina Brown. So those three classes, and so those 772 and 773 are the literacy classes. So these three courses make up the basis for you to be intern eligible. Typically people will take them in the first semester. But if you're not, no worries, just change the sheet. This should come to you in a, as a Word document. So you can just, you know, delete it and retype it in the semester you need it to be in. Now, how do you know what you need to take? So you probably remember like the catalog and, and information you got up front, but you may not have like, where did I keep a copy of that? Or how do I keep track of it? When you log in on the second page of this Word doc, you see a screenshot. So when you log in to your Toro One portal, you should see a little icon with a little graduation cap that'll say degree works. When you click on degree works, this is a screen that you should see. So this is a screen of somebody who, has, who is registered for these first three classes in the first semester. Um, uh, actually, no, this is actually blank blank. This is somebody who hasn't even registered at all. This is, I pulled a screenshot of a new student who will be joining us in the spring so that you would be able to see uh, a totally blank sheet. Yours, in fact, would look a little bit different because in the on the right side margin in that orange band, it's actually going to tell you which semester that you're taking the class. So you should see your classes say fall 2021 in the right hand uh, column, that big blank spot on that orange band there down below. So on this screen anyway, it's just, it'll have your name, your TUID number, some basic information about you. Uh, and then you will see that, um, oh look, and here's Zarina joining me now because I, she's joining me early and I'm trying to record this before my 3.30 meeting. So, uh, so let me continue. So on the bottom of the screen, you'll see that here are the courses listed that you need to take to complete a teacher credential at Toro University. Every time you come into this degree work screen every semester, it will be updated. It will show you what you're currently taking. Taking, it will show you what you've already taken and it will show you what you have yet to take. It will also show you that degree progress bar that you see at the top that shows you what percent of your completion you have made in the program. So this is your best way of tracking your classes, of knowing what you still need to take, 
and then looking at our course schedule, which is always posted in the GSOE community. You could go there right now, look under the general course um, resources, and you'll see the spring course schedule that will give you the CRN numbers to register for your classes. The CRN numbers are just a quick way of registering for classes. You can just type in the CRN instead of like searching for the course name and number and, it, and you can just add those classes. If something changes in your status or, or teaching or student teaching or intern teaching, all those things, feel free to hit Dory's drop-in hours or make an appointment with me. We will walk you through it. And if we need, if we need to make a schedule change with you, we will take care of that. So you can rely on us for those things. In the meantime, this should hopefully get you going so that every semester you feel a little bit more confident in knowing what to register for and when. At the top of the page, just a reminder, here's the Zoom link and hours for, for Dory's um, drop-in times, Mondays and Wednesdays, so that if you need any help on the fly, she's there to help. And of course, uh, you all have my and, um, appointment link on my calendar. I didn't want to put it on this document because we might share this document with other programs. And so I don't want everybody to get an appointment with me. I just need you all to make appointments with me. So I hope you have a lovely break during the semester and I look forward to working with you next semester. Thanks so much.